I'm Laurie Thomas with the University of Kentucky Forestry and Natural Resources Extension, and I'm here with the tree of the week, the Swamp White Oak. Swamp White Oak, Quercus bicolor, is a member of the White Oak Group. It is one of 20 plus species of oak found in Kentucky. Swamp White Oak is a medium sized tree that grows 60 to 80 feet tall and 24 to 36 inches in diameter. It is a relatively long-lived species reaching 300 to 350 years of age. In forest stands, it has a straight trunk with ascending branches and a narrow crown. However, open-grown trees tend to have an irregular crown and persistent lower branches. Swamp white oak is often planted on golf courses, parks, and naturalized areas. The wood is valuable and commonly lumped in with white oak Quercus alba wood, and the acorns provide food for a variety of wildlife. Swamp White Oak's range includes North Central and Northeastern United States with scattered groups in Tennessee and North Carolina. It is scattered across Kentucky except in the eastern half of the state. It grows in lowlands along stream edges and swampy areas that receive periodic flooding. It is not found in permanently flooded soils. Swamp White Oak is classed as intermediate and shade tolerance. Swamp white oak is deciduous with alternately arranged simple leaves. The leaves are obovate in shape and 3 to 7 inches long and 2 to 4 inches wide. The leaf margins have irregular blunt teeth. The leaves are shiny dark green above and very pale below. And fall leaf color ranges from golden to yellow to burgundy to copper. This species is monoecious, meaning a tree has both male and female flowers, as with other oaks. The male flowers are yellow-green catkins that are two to four inches long, and the female flowers are very small, usually green to red, and found in the leaf axils. They both appear with the leaves, and the flowers are wind-pollinated. The fruit is an acorn that's about one inch long and tan in color. The acorn cap covers about one-third of the acorn. They are usually born in doubles and on a two inch long stalk. The acorns mature in one growing season and ripen in September to October. Acorns germinate as soon as they fall. Swamp white oak trees begin seed production around 20 years of age with optimum seed bearing age between 75 and 200 years. Trees produce good seed crops every three to five years with light seed crops during the intervening years. Gravity rodents, and water disperse the acorns. The bark is gray and scaly. As the tree ages, the bark develops irregular fissures and ridges. A distinctive feature of swamp white oak is the peeling bark along the branches. The wood of swamp white oak is hard and strong and shares many of the same traits as white oak, Quercus alba. It has medium to large pores, it is ring porous, and with abundant tyloses in the larger pores. And tyloses are the balloon-like outgrowths of parenchyma cells in the large xylem cells, and they block water movement, which helps white oak's wood to be watertight. It has distinct growth rings, and swamp white oak is rated as having good resistance to decay. It is a commercially valuable wood and is used for cabinetry, furniture, interior trim, flooring, barrels, and veneer. Swamp white oak, like other oaks, is an important tree species for wildlife. Oaks are one of the top 10 trees for wildlife, according to the National Wildlife Federation. Squirrel, bear, and white-tailed deer eat the swamp white oak acorns. Varieties of birds also rely on the acorns, including ducks, geese, woodpeckers, wild turkey, and blue jays. And oaks support a wide variety of lepidopteran larval species, including the imperial moth, and hair streaks and dusky wings. The national champion swamp white oak is in Sussex, New Jersey as of 2021. It is 268 inches in circumference, 105 feet tall, with a 102 foot crown spread. Kentucky currently does not have a champion swamp white oak. If you'd like to know more about champion trees, check out American Forest National Champion Trees or check out the Kentucky Division of Forestry Champion Trees. Now for a few fun facts about swamp white oak. Native Americans and pioneers used to eat the acorns both raw and cooked. They would also grind them into a powder and used it as a thickening in stews or mixed with cereals for making bread. 
Mulch of the dead leaves is reported to repel slugs, grubs, and various insects. The genus name, Quercus, is Latin for the oak trees, and the specific epithet, bicolor, is from Latin and references the two colors of the leaf, which are dark green above and pale below. I hope you get the opportunity to get out into your woodlands, a local park, or your neighborhood and enjoy the beautiful trees of Kentucky, including the Swamp White Oak.